hello my lovelies and welcome back to yet another video if this is your first time ever seeing my face my name is Kendra and I create fashion wellness and lifestyle content and if you are a returning subscriber you already know what it is I've got quite a few new items in my closet so I thought why not give you guys a haul so I'm gonna be showing you a bunch of clothes that I've recently got as well as a bunch of accessories as well so let's not waste any time and let's get into it okay so first up I have this long sleeve um, top slash dress from Shein so it has like pearl buttons it's so pretty on and I just love how it curves on my body when all the buttons are closed it's quite sheer so it's a bit see-through so in the daytime I will wear it with a bra but usually I really don't um, care enough to wear it with a bra at night because it is sheer but it isn't that sheer so I can get away with I'm wearing no bra with it at night but I absolutely love this I've worn this out already and I'm telling you I felt so good in it it also has like frilled edges as well and I love that I could wear it open or only tie like a couple of buttons in the top and leave the rest opened I don't feel comfortable to wear this as a dress like on its own because it is short it is sheer and I am curvy maybe on the beach you know maybe as a cover-up on the beach but I did buy it um, knowing that you know it might be too skimpy and it might be too short for me um, to feel comfortable wearing it as a dress so I knew that I wanted to wear it as like a longer length uh, top and then next from Shein I got these zebra pants so these pants are one of the most comfortable pants that i own i've also worn this before and oh my goodness i felt so comfortable in these they're so nice and soft i bought a similar style to this but in tie-dye and i absolutely loved it and practically loving them they're so comfortable so i thought why not get a couple of more i mean different prints and colors so i'm really glad that i got these and i have been needing you know really nice tight fitted pants um, that I can like maybe throw in a shirt with or, and dress up or down so I really love these they're such a nice like statement piece so I could throw on like just a plain um, longer length shirt just accessorize you know and have this pants be the standout item so I really love these and I know I'm gonna get a lot of wear um, out of this because I do levitate to a lot of my other um, tight fitting flared out pants so I thought you know what let me get more in different colors and prints uh, so I could style so yeah I really love this one and then I got a similar cut but in this like velvety material I'm not gonna lie these don't fit like I would want them to so I definitely wanted them to be a bit more tight so I should have sized down actually which is weird because these are already a medium it doesn't fit tight around my leg and it doesn't fit the way it is like presented on the model <sighs> I don't know like maybe I can still figure out a way to style these I'm not gonna lie like I haven't given them much thought and I feel like I'm up for the challenge so I don't know I'm gonna see it's giving like pajama pants especially the way that it fits but yeah mm -hmm, a bit of a fail here if they don't work I'll just end up turning them into home pants and just wearing them at home when I'm chilling because it is a nice um, soft material and then for the next item is the pants that I'm actually wearing I mean you guys have seen these pants all over they're just plain black uh, flared out pants with like the ruching in the middle and in the back you know they're plain nothing special but I'm not gonna lie these are also quite comfortable and I'm getting a lot of wear out of them i think i've worn them like two times already two three times already since i got them i don't think i'm comfortable enough to wear them with like a short top because the material is quite thin but i like to throw them on with like a shirt or like a longer length top so i did wear this with the black long sleeve pearl top and it looks so amazing one of those plain items that i can throw on when i don't really know what to wear and i've been needing like just like plain simple tight fitted bottoms so i know that i'm gonna get a lot of wear out of these and then next I got two gym sets from Shein if you guys watched my last haul you would have seen um, the green gym set that I included I am absolutely obsessed with that gym set and I was actually so taken aback by the quality so much so that I was like you know what I'm going to buy more sets from Shein 
especially because I've been wanting to go back to the gym. So I decided to go for the short uh, lilac set and then just like a plain black set. These fit quite nice. I mean, they're quite decent. I'm not gonna lie, they are quite thin. Um, I was expecting them to be more thick, so it's definitely not like the material um, of my other set that I got. I think I'm gonna try find a similar set to the green set because I really love that material. It's so thick. And the bras also came padded, and these ones aren't padded. But to be honest, even though the quality isn't, you know, exactly like the green set, this is still decent. I still will wear this. I wore the shorts yesterday, and the shorts do like roll up a bit, but I mean, I was sitting down, so I don't think it's that deep, but I am keen to see how these hold up in the wash. You know, because it's thin, maybe I won't um, put them in the wash, maybe I'll hand wash them. Yeah, all in all, you know, quite a decent set. I don't really have that many complaints and I will be wearing them to Germany. And then I got this Varsity jacket from Supre, which is a brand under the Cotton On umbrella. So full disclosure, I was doing a campaign for Supre, so I did not um, pay for this. But yeah, I still love this jacket. It is a jacket that I definitely will be wearing. I really like the color and the fit. It's quite nice and oversized. So I can, you know, wear like chunky um, sweaters underneath. This is really going to come in handy um, during winter. So for the last item of clothing, I wanted to show you guys uh, this dress. It is so, so, so pretty. So I got this off of Yaga. I mentioned this in one of my other vlogs where I initially bought it for a wedding that I was attending in December, but the wedding didn't end up happening just as well because the dress didn't come in time. It's like the champagne color. It fits, honestly, like a glove. I really love the way it fits. It is a bit sheer, I'm not gonna lie, but I personally don't have an issue with that. I love how sexy it looks on. It's just so pretty and I love the color. I haven't found the right occasion to wear this yet, so I haven't worn it yet, but I'm definitely um, looking forward to wearing it. Actually, I think I might do a shoot with this. Like, Why not do amazing makeup and take some pictures in this? I don't know. I'm gonna think about it, but yeah, I haven't gotten a chance to wear this dress, but I am really looking forward to wearing it and styling it. I love how it like drapes in the front and it's open back. It's just such a pretty dress. Okay, so moving on to accessories, I got a bunch of stuff, guys, to show you. So first up is this cream bag from Cotton On. I got this to form part of my campaign that I was doing for them. So I went into the store to get this bag and um, just to accessorize the whole look that I was shooting for them. So I got this from a cotton on voucher where we needed to pick out accessories. So I did pick this um, out myself. Such a cute, simple bag. I really didn't have anything like this in my wardrobe. I love how, I love this ruching on the top. It's so pretty and I love the color. And I feel like this can really be thrown on with almost anything, to be honest. I really don't have like any girly bags in my wardrobe. And the bag that I bought from Sheen, the brown bag, I showed you guys in my last haul. I gave that to my sister. And that was like the only small, like, pretty handbag that I had. So I was like, you know what? Let me grab something like this because I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe. But I am actually quite looking forward to getting more of these type of bags as well. I think... I feel like Sheen has like a couple that I might like. But yeah, quite a nice simple bag. It's also a nice size as well. I can fit quite a bit in here. And I love that it has this like magnetic clasp here. So all in all, quite a cute purchase. And this definitely will be like my go-to uh, small handbag. Okay, so all of the accessories I'm about to show you are all from Shein. I went quite ham with the accessories this time around. So whenever I shop on Shein, I go there with the plan. So, you know, I'll put things in my wish list and I'll just like throw things into my cart like as the weeks go by. But when it comes down to me actually buying, I try and figure out, okay, like what do I actually need? Like, you know, do I need more accessories? You know, am I looking more for, you know, like pants? Like what am I actually looking for? So this time around, when it came to clothing, I was focused more on like getting, you know, tight fitted, comfortable pants and a lot of accessories. So first up is this like fluffy hat. You guys know 
these hats have been all the rage right now in fashion so i got this cute one how cute is this i wore this out already and it was an absolute hit i really love it it's quite cute the only thing i don't like about this hat is the fur does come out quite a bit like it does shed i don't know how to stop that i wish there was like a spray that i could maybe spray um that would prevent that and it is a bit bothersome when i wear it so like you know it sticks on my my lipstick um, it even goes into my eye so that's the only thing i don't like about this hat but other than that it's quite comfortable it's quite um warm as well but other than that i really do love it i like that it's not as thick so i could also you know get away with wearing it um in warmer weather as well just to accessorize my look but you know it is something that i will be throwing on during winter as well and then i got this black and white one that we've all been seeing on social media this one is so cute i love how cute it is i've been wanting these type of hats for the longest time and the only other place that i saw them at was asos and i'm like you know what no I'm not gonna buy a bunch of accessories on ASOS and then pay the exact same price for customs basically so I was like you know what let me try um, other alternatives so I'm glad that I did find these on Shein hopefully they will upload more um, because I really like them and I definitely want more colors of these hats and then I got like a bunch of shades from Shein I've been wanting more shades but more specifically clear shades so i got a couple of these oh guys i love them so much so i got like these big clear frames they're actually blue light glosses so i got a tortoiseshell um print and then i got like a plain black one as well that i think are so pretty so the reason why i bought these two specifically was one for blue light but also i wanted to see if i could turn them into prescription glasses so for you guys who don't know i actually do wear glasses so if you see me without glasses i either can't see or i'm wearing contacts <laughs> and i only have one pair of prescription glasses so i've been really looking to you know turning um, a couple of my sunglasses into prescription glasses and also getting more cool frames i haven't been able to find like really dope frames like this for prescription glasses it's always like the standard um shape and i really want more funky shapes for my prescription glasses so i was like you know what the next best thing is actually buying like different frames and different sunglasses and turning them into prescription glasses so i heard that they can't turn every single like frame into prescription glasses because it depends on the shape of the frame i'm holding thumbs that i can change these ones because oh my gosh imagine like if i could make prescription glasses like how cool would these look these look so cool but i'm gonna hold thumbs and hopefully they can do that and then i also got like a slightly uh, more orange tortoiseshell print I like these i love these these are like very orange i even i'm like i'm seeing orange as well but i really like the color of these and i love how it fits on my face they're quite nice i also um, wanted to steer away from getting dark glasses because why not these are on trend but also i want to be able to see right so if i'm wearing my contact lenses but i still want to wear um glasses i can see perfectly and with glasses like these you can get away with wearing them at night because they aren't dark so that's another reason why i got them so i'm really happy with these purchases i was a bit skeptical with the bigger frames i thought it might not suit me but i think it goes so well with my face shape and i definitely want to look out um for more colors in these because i really love them i know my mom would love these as well so maybe i'll actually get her a pair so yeah these are quite cool and i'm definitely looking forward to getting more and then i got two pairs of earrings so the first ones are these silver hoops i did purchase these ones before but um the clasp broke on one of them and i'm so bummed because i really love these earrings and i have similar gold hoops so i thought you know what let me get silver hoops because there's times where you know my outfit might not go with gold accessories so i wanted more silver accessories so i was like you know what let me just purchase another pair um, of these and i'm gonna make sure that i take good care of these so yeah and then i also got these gold earrings because i don't have earrings like this so these are quite a statement piece so you know when i'm wearing something you know quite plain and i just need like a pop 
um, of accessories to you know elevate the look I can throw these on and then the drama queen in me could not resist this necklace it's giving queen it's giving victorian i love it so much i actually saw this necklace um well saw a similar one on pinterest i think i was going through you know some style images you know trying to get some style inspiration and i saw someone wearing a necklace like this but styled it in such a dope way and i was like hmm this is quite a nice like statement piece especially if you're not trying to go like the princess route if you guys know what i mean so imagine like wearing like a plain tee with you know cool pair of jeans and just like throwing on this necklace i don't know it's not for everyone but i feel like i can definitely pull this off and i feel like it's so stylish even with this i mean even with the shirt that i'm wearing guys look at that oh that is so pretty it's one of those things where i'm like you know what other people might not see it but i see the vision i see the vision so i kind of like know i have an idea of how i'm gonna style it and then i got these sheer gloves honestly guys i'm really loving this style if you guys saw my previous haul you would have seen that i had purchased long velvet gloves and i was like you know what i love this look and I really like the whole vibe of like wearing gloves and like having rings. I think it's so cool. So I thought, you know what? Let me get um, sheer ones. And I also saw a girl styling them. So she had on like sheer gloves with a couple of rings, but then she had like this oversized um, gray blazer. And I was like, oh my God, this is so me. This is so my style. I'm really loving the whole gloves vibe with rings. And I definitely like want to make it a thing. I feel like it's just a fun accessory to be honest with you that can really elevate a look. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to styling these. And then lastly, I got these sandals from Cotton On. So these were also part of my styling voucher that I got from Cotton On. So I grabbed these heels. And the reason why I got these is because my other go-to heels from Mr. Price, so they were like strappy heels, also quite a short heel. Those ones snapped and I was so sad because they were honestly like my go-to shoes. Every time that I needed to elevate a look but I didn't want to wear a high heel, I always grabbed those. So now that I didn't have them, I didn't have any other sandal. So I was like, you know what, let me get... Um, these ones from Cotton On. Cotton On is honestly the go-to place for these type of sandals. And I love that there's so many options for low to mid heels. So I picked these up. I absolutely love them. And it's so my style as well. I love how simple they are. But like this fat strap really, you know, makes it quite edgy and unique. So I really love these. I love how my foot looks. And I also love quite a, a square heel. So yeah, these, as you can see, they're actually quite dirty now because I wear them so often and i really love them so they are a short enough heel for me to comfortably walk in but still high enough to make me feel like you know i am wearing heels and like you know i am elevating my look so i really love these i think i need to purchase more to be honest but i always go for black pairs i think i need to go for like a different color maybe a white or a beige i don't know but yeah these have really been my go-to sandal and i honestly live in these when i don't want to wear flats or when my outfit calls for um, a higher shoe but yeah i'm really loving these and they definitely will be my go-to heels so that is it for my haul i will be sure to leave links in the comment section so definitely check that out as always thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye